Recently, on September 29th, 2015, scientists at Stanford discovered that mealworms, uh, the larva form of the darkling beetle, were able to eat and decompose polystyrene, which we know is styrofoam cups. Um, so my students decided to conduct an experiment to see if this was actually possible and how healthy the worms were after doing this. So they placed polyethylene, which is plastic bags, in a water bottle. And all that we have found in six days worth is that this colony of approximately 50 has taken off, you see the discoloration there, has taken off the surface layer of this styrofoam cup. Um, and so that's all they've been able to do. Before September, scientists discovered that uh, wax worms, which are the larval stage of a, um, of a moth, could actually eat polyethylene, which is plastic bags and water bottles. Um, and they are the best at breaking down the plastic in their digestive system, which then releases it as frass, which can then be used as fertilizer, and it's a completely um, earth filling product. And uh, as you see here, they have not really touched anything. So then my students were curious to see if superworms were um, as successful or um, more so because they are larger. And we discovered that, as you can see here, um, the superworms have put quite a um, quite a dent in this styrofoam cup here. They have not touched the uh, polyethylene plastic, um, and they are more active and larger. So stay tuned. We'll be posting more results soon, and hopefully having a larger colony than just 50 um, eventually. So like, subscribe, and comment.